metformin or glucophage, as it's widely known, is an anti-diabetic medication used to treat insulin resistance. Metformin is the first-line therapy of type 2 diabetes in obese patients. Metformin belongs to a class of medications called biquanides, and it's the only one in that class. The mechanism of action of metformin is very interesting, as it is different than other antihyperglycemic medications. Metformin works through three methods. Decreasing blood glucose by decreasing hepatic glucose production. Decreasing intestinal absorption of glucose. And by improving insulin sensitivity by increasing the peripheral glucose uptake and utilization. All of these effects are mediated by the ability of metformin to activate AMP activated protein kinase or AMPK. AMPK is a liver enzyme that has a crucial role in insulin signaling, whole body energy balance, and the metabolism of glucose and fats. Metformin also increases AMPK activity in skeletal muscles. As a result of activating AMPK, it facilitates the opening of GLOT4 in the plasma membrane, which results in the insulin-independent glucose uptake. Insulin is an amazing drug in the sense that it lowers blood glucose levels without causing hypoglycemia. But no medication is perfect. Metformin has some common side effects, some of which are chest pain, elevated hepatic enzymes, nausea and vomiting, and lactic acidosis. Lactic acidosis is thought to be caused by a decrease in liver uptake of serum lactate, one of the substrate of gluconeogenesis. In people with healthy renal function, the excess lactate will be cleared. However, metformin should be given with caution in people with any renal impairment. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you liked the video, make sure to like it, subscribe, and tell me your suggestions for any future videos. And see you next time.